Hello boys and girls. It's Homebrew Wednesday. And uh, actually, what am I doing? Hey, hey guys, Jonah here. It's Homebrew Wednesday again. Don't worry, no more singing, I promise. Well, maybe not this week anyway. <laughs> um, check this out, man. This is, if you guys have been watching my non-Homebrew Wednesday, and I've only done one recently, we've got a bubbling airlock of doom. Um, and this is after three days, I think, something like that. Um, it's a wine kit that I'm doing. Um, it's meant to be a rosé, but check out that colour, man. It's dark as, dark as Satan's codpiece. Um, and look at that, it's obviously, um, can you see here? The level's obviously bubbled up, and I'm getting some massive amount of fermentation going on. So yeah, must be working, eh? Now, that's not the only thing I got. And um, I'll give them a shout, because why not? We're here to uh, help each other, aren't we? Homebrew shop dot, no, what's it? Yeah, homebrewshop.co.uk? I think it might be dot com. Just put home space brew space shop, um, and it's the UK one, yeah. Guys in there are really cool. There's always some, uh, I recognize a couple of guys. I've been there about eight, nine times. I usually get stuff online, to be honest, but I've uh, been in their shop a few times. Um, really cool, always um, oily smiley, quite good fun. And they've usually got things on offer that aren't on the website. So if you go down there and give them a bit of a, give them a wink and say anything on offer, uh, you can pick stuff up pretty cheap. Um, and hey, homebrew, you know how I do it. I'm a cheap kind of guy. Um, oh, bless me, and I haven't even had any beers yet. Anyway, what else did I get? Well, let's have a look. I've got a big, big old bag of grains. Let's see how good the old camera is. You got some pale malt, yeah? But, just in case, that didn't work. Got some crystal malt. I've also got some chocolate malt, but I've used that, so I don't want to spill it all over the table. What else have we got? Oh, we've got some Goldings pellets. We've got some Halatau pellets. Got a big old chunk of, uh, what's this one? Fuggles, chunk of Fuggles. And uh, hey, guess what we got here? Got some Bramley Cross as well. Um, so what does this mean? This means I'm gonna have a go at some brewage, some all grain. Um, but what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do, um, going to do a one gallon batches. Until I get the recipe right, um, I'm going to go for the one gallon job. Which um, I know people do, and people on the forums and stuff say they do, but I've never actually seen anyone do one, like um, on YouTube or whatever. Um, most people go for the big, the big bad boys, <laughs> and I can see why, but I don't want to waste um, any brews, you know, especially on an all grain. So I'm going to do a few until I get the recipe. Mmm, a spice of midwives. <laughs> Hey, guess what? I got some other stuff too. Check this out. I know, I know, it's probably too late now. But have a look at that. Slows. So we got some nice slows in here. Probably going to be more like next year now. But I'm going to do some slow gin. Um, see how, how good we get. One thing though, one question is... Um, does it matter how strong the alcohol is? Because the cheapest one I can find um, is is lower in alcohol. Strange, strangely enough, um, it's thirty seven point five. Um, and usually, if I'm brewing, I'll go for the strongest mofo. <laughs> go for the strongest one I can. Um, and obviously, because I'm adding sugar, I'm adding slows, I'm adding everything. Um, it's going to detract on the alcohol anyway. So, is, is that important? I mean, I could get an export strength um, at 43% alcohol, um, but it's a lot more expensive. So, question for you guys out there in Brewland: um, Should I go for the cheapest gin I can find, or should I go for the strongest one? Um, obviously, the slow is going to affect the flavour, but do you think the alcohol matters? I mean, it's going to be six, going to be about six percent difference, and you know what my maths is like; it's terrible. Um, so yeah, does that matter? That's the question to you. Hopefully you can uh, respond down, not my belly, down below, yeah? Um, anyway, that's all I've got to say. Brewing is good. I'm, I'm doing some brewing at long last. 
Um, so I've got a wine on the go, gonna do an all grain batch, gonna do my slow gin. Hey, what more can I say? Life is good. Um, even if at work it's not going so well, Hey, I'm not going to talk about that on, on camera, but um, yeah, I was pretty down over the last few weeks. Um, but now I'm brewing again. I'm back up. Okay, guys, have a lovely homebrew Wednesday, and we'll see you soon. Take care.